Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. I posted a video a couple of days ago that Microsoft had rolled out Power Toys version 0.53.1, which was quite a major version update to the Power Toys utility because it featured the new always on top utility, bug fixes and improvements, and also had new options for both your File Explorer a preview pane and also Power Toys Run had received some improvements as well. Now, since the release of version 53.1, Microsoft has now updated and released another update for Power Toys, which is, takes it to now version 0.53.3. So we've just gone from 0.1 to 0.3, as this is addressing uh, stability issues and bugs in the Power Toys Run utility. So if you use this utility, and have had some issues. Microsoft has addressed um, these issues in this latest update, version 53.3. Now, Power Toys Run, if you toggle it on, you can just, as it says in the activation shortcut, you can just uh, press your Alt and Space keys and that will um, activate Power Toys Run. So that's Alt and Space. And those bugs that have been addressed uh, the first is that Power Toys Run performance regression uh, was due to disabling list first virtualization to improve the scroll speed on some computers. That has been addressed. And then the URI plugin for Power Toys Run had an exception with a bad format. And then the last improvement and stability fix is that Power Toys Run crashed due to a duplicate key. Now this was due to community a community a community driven plugin. Um, that had the same name as one of the Power Toys plugins. So if you had experienced any issues with Power Toys Run, then just check your up to date. And now you can do this. There's two ways. You can just head over to GitHub, where you can uh, download the latest version straight from GitHub, where Power Toys is maintained and developed by Microsoft. Or you can also just the easiest, if, if you have the app already installed, just check for updates and that will update you to that latest version, uh, 0.53.3, which fixes those three stability issues and bugs in the Power Toys Run utility. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.